Pakistan's Prime Minister Imran Khan says there'll be retaliation as India launches any military response to the recent suicide bombing in Indian administered Kashmir. Mr Khan says his country had nothing to do with the attack that killed 40 Indian soldiers and that the dispute can only be solved with dialogue. He hears in a televised announcement. If you are thinking to attack Pakistan, Pakistan will not just think to retaliate, Pakistan will retaliate. Pakistan will not have any other way than to retaliate. I hope that better sense will prevail. We will show wisdom and this issue will at last be resolved, like in Afghanistan, through dialogue and discussions. Well, I spoke to our correspondent Sekunda Kamani, who is in Islamabad, and asked him what else the, president, the Prime Minister had to say. Prime Minister Imran Khan said that India had leveled allegations uh, against Pakistan without any evidence. He said that Pakistan was being used as a whipping boy by the Indian authorities uh, for the problems in Kashmir. He suggested that Indian authorities should introspect more on the root causes of the violence, uh, alluding to allegations of human rights abuses by Indian security forces in Kashmir, uh, which he suggested would be the, the, the underlying causes of the, of the tensions that are going on there. Um, Imran Khan also said that uh, if uh, India has any uh, actionable intelligence that any Pakistanis were involved um, in last week's attack, then that should be shared and his government would act upon it. But as you say, he cautioned against any kind of military intervention by India, saying that Pakistan would not hesitate to retaliate. Sekunda, the group Ajaysh al-Muhammad said it's carried out the attack. What do we know about them? Yes, that's right. Uh, Jesh al Muhammad is a, a Pakistani-based militant group, uh, and this is the, one of the key questions about this episode. It wasn't really addressed by Prime Minister Imran Khan. Jesh al Muhammad is a banned organization um, in Pakistan. It has been banned for a number of years now, uh, but many believe because of its uh, past close links with the intelligence services here that it's still allowed to operate uh, secretly. Uh, Imran Khan uh, asked the, the rhetorical question, what would the Pakistani state have to gain from any kind of involvement uh, with an attack like this um, uh, and seemed to suggest that, uh, that the country would now no longer want it in, in any way for uh, militant groups to be able to operate here and go out into India or into Afghanistan and and uh, be responsible for violence there. But I think this concern uh, amongst the Indian authorities about this group, Jesh and Muhammad, will remain and tensions are likely to continue between the two neighbours.